Hello, everyone. This is Cecilia. Today, we're going to learn an advanced function, which could let you use just a simple click to realize some complex functions, like drawing a basic graphic, read one VP data, and send them to another VP. Here we see there are three pressing modes: first press, continuous pressing, and losing pressing. First press means the very first time you tap the touch screen. Continuous pressing means you hold pressing, and losing pressing is the time your finger away from the touch screen. These three moves work separately, and if they are all enabled. You can realize three functions. Okay, you can see there is another mode options for each pressing, but T five L kernel only supports zero zero and zero one modes. Zero zero means the data of V P one S will not be returned to the serial port, while zero one, on the contrary. VP one S is a VP address you can define, and you will write the function data at this address. VP one T is the VP where you want to send the function data. For easy understanding, you first save something in VP one S, and the thing will be directly sent to VP one T when you press. Okay, let's do a practice. What about drawing a full arc on the display? For a common operation, we place a basic graphics display control, and send the serial command by the simulator. This time, we just use a click. First step, you will place a basic graphics here. And set its VP. Here we set twenty eighty, and you place a cycle data return on the bottom. Here we just enable first press mode and set VP one S as twenty ninety and VP one T twenty eighty the same to basic graphics. Now let view the common format of drawing a full arc. Which will be. We only need to write the data part. At the VP one S in file twenty two and data length is twelve bytes. One more important thing, make sure, write the data in file twenty two after you generate and save your program. Otherwise, the tool will refresh the address data to none. So, writing the data in file twenty two is last step. Okay, now we save the data string into file twenty two at according address. Since file twenty two displays data by bytes, not words, so you need to time two of the VP. Okay, data screen saved. Let's power the screen. Just one click, and the circle shows. Hope this video will be a little bit inspiring. Thank you.